If you look him up, it'll say the father of modern medicine. Some of you will get confused and go, I thought Hippoc Hippocrates was the father of medicine. Yeah, because you're forgetting, I said modern, I didn't say medicine. I said modern medicine. Until Ibn Sina, medicine looked like this. There was disease, and the way disease affected you but was based on, did you eat fish and drink milk? And did a black cat walk in front of you? Was Jupiter in alignment with Saturn? If so, when disease hits you, you're going to bleed from the eyes and have uncontrollable bowel movements. Ibn Sina walks up and goes, this is nonsense. What are you talking about? There isn't disease, there's diseases. They're all different and they have different transmission vectors. So one disease, you sneeze on it, you get it. Another disease, you touch fecal matter and you get it. Another disease is bloodborne. Another disease is, comes by insects. Another disease comes from, from rats. In other words, what we need to do is we need to think about the transmission vectors. In his book, here you go, Kanun Atib. Kanun means law, Q-A-N-U-N. <laughs> so if you're, if you're in physics and they say you need to read the canon, canon, C-A-N-O-N, not C-A-N-N-O-N, means law because it's an Arabic word. You're using an Arabic word. Qanun is Q-A-N-U-N. It doesn't have to be, but that's how I'm spelling it. It could be with two O's or... So, <clears throat> The Canon of Medicine is the book he writes. In it, he includes hundreds of cures. We still use a bunch of those cures today. In Europe and, and the Middle East, his book is still necessary reading in medical school. But that's not what's interesting about him. Here's what he says. He says, you know what's better than all these cures I stuck in here? Prevention. Your goal is not to get the disease to begin with. If you cannot get the disease, that's way better than getting the disease, risking dying and getting cured, and then dealing with the side effects of the disease later. That's why he's the father of modern medicine. He's that guy who said, interrupt the transmission vectors. So when I was taught this in school, I was taught that Semmelweis, the Hungarian, figured this out. Yes, Semmelweis, the Hungarian, figured it out again, 800 years after Ibn Sina figured it out first. Ibn